we're on. Hi, this is Ed O'Donnell. Today we're tying a green weenie, which was really started in the mid-50s by Russ Mowry and Ken Igo out in western Pennsylvania. It's a pretty easy uh, to fly to tie. Um, also, Charlie Meck uh, picked it up in his 1989 book uh, on uh, Pennsylvania hatches. Uh, the way we're going to do it is the Charlie Meck style. It's going to be weighted up towards the front. The hook I'm using is an R74 9672. I'm using just plain fluorescent green chenille, and I'm using um, basically ultra thread in olive. And here we go. You start it up, put on a base, work it to the back, trim off the tag. I use a lot of glue when I do this. That's just the way I tie. Some people don't use any glue at all. A little glue on there. This is lead. It's 0 0.010. You take about 10 wraps up in the front. Don't crowd the head, pull it off. Bring it back like this. Take the thread, work it into the lead. Bring it back here. Take the green chenille. Go ahead and bring out the two threads in the green chenille by stripping it like this. Lay it over top of the thread. Like this. And then you wind the rest of the chenille right on the body of the, the shank of the hook so you keep the taper the same. When you get to the, just to before the bend of the hook, take two or three wraps, anchor it, make a loop about the size and diameter of a pencil eraser. You bring it in like that, like that, like that. Take it up to the front, like this. Bring this around here. Nice tight loops. This fly is working on a variety of fish, trout, bass, uh, shad, uh, carp, all kinds of panfish. You get right to the very end, bring this up tight, like this. And then just capture it with your thread. Go behind it, like this, like this. Take this, cut it off, push the thread away so you don't cut it with the uh, knife. I use a knife, I don't use scissors most of the time. Then you want to basically uh, take a half hitch tool, which I should have right here, and put a few half hitches on it. You can go like this. Like that. Take that off, put a little head cement on it. Take a needle, clean the eye of the hook out, like that, and just take this, and there's a green weenie right there. Works very well on a whole variety of fish right there. That's it.